What's up, YouTube? How's everybody doing? Hope everybody's having a great night. Got me my Marvel Collector Core, which is none other than Guardians of the Galaxy. Um, I may have only seen one spot. I seem to get this box like two days after everybody else. So, man, they're quick to post it on Facebook uh, and everything like that. So, I think I might have got a peek of one thing. But other than that, I really don't know what's in this box. So, that's great. Um, and normally this box comes really late in the month, and this one comes kind of early, mid-month, mid so very cool. Um, now, let's see what's in this box for this month. This is a bi-monthly box. It is marble, Funko together, so it's about 30, roughly about 32 bucks every two months, though. It's every two months, so that's what makes it pretty cool. Uh, the next one I know after this one for, um, let's see, I think it's, uh, this is December, so it would be February's, but it's Deadpool. So if you're a Deadpool fan, be prepared. They're going to have one for Deadpool. So, all right, but let's crack into this box without further ado and see what they sent us this month for Guardians of the Galaxy. It's a pretty big box. I mean, it's a decent sized box, so let's check it out. Now, normally, you get your patch and pen. So, let's see what we got here. Oh, very cool. So, the patch this month is none other than my son's favorite character, Mr. Rocket Raccoon. So, very cool. I'm sure that will be gone shortly, as soon as he sees it. I guarantee anything with Rocket, it's gone. So, and then the pen for this month is Groot. I am Groot. All right, moving on. Let's see what they packed in this bad boy. I'm not gonna be able to hold this. I want to actually bend down and grab some of this stuff. So, all right, first thing I feel is a comic book, and. It is a number one, and it is Guardians of the Infinity, and it is like a Christmas tree Groot with Rocket down below, and I think that's pretty cute, uh, especially for the holidays. Um, Guardians of Infinity. So it is a bag and board comic, and that is cute, especially for holiday edition. Rocket dressing up Groot as Christmas tree. Spot on. Definitely like that. Alright. Next. There's something weird in here. Hold on. Okay. We've got... It looks like a scarf. Interesting. I was not expecting that. And on one side, it is a very big, giant, potted root. If you guys can see that in there. This thing is huge. Wow. Wow. I mean, it's a very nice scarf. And then the other side is Guardians of the Galaxy. It looks like it has all the characters on there. So that is interesting. I don't wear scarves. But it, it does seem like a very, very well put together scarf. Am I hanging up? I don't know. We'll see. Don't know what to quite think of that one. All right, next, moving on. Well, if I can grab it here. All right, moving on. We have Funko Pop Bobbleheads. It's an exclusive, and it is Root and Rocket Raccoon. Huh. And it's, uh, oh, looks like, uh, almost looks like a, uh, that you can hang these up or something. I'm not real sure. Let's see if we can get them out. Alright. Okay. They open up just like popsicles, so we're good. Alright. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, they're, um, actually they're ornaments. Um, so that's neat. Um, again, 
with licensing, they have to be bobbleheads because uh, Marvel's a bobblehead. But they are, they're actually ornaments for your tree. Now that is different. Very cool. So you get Groot, you get potted Groot, excuse me, and you get Rocket. So those may go on my tree. I may very well do that. But it is a exclusive bubbles. They're called bubbles. Bobblers. Bobblers. I get it right. I'll get it right one of these times. So um I think that's all they have on this because that's all they have on the back. So it's the first time I've seen these, but they are an exclusive Marvel Collector Core, so very interesting. This box is interesting this month, so alright, let's see what else do we have in here. We have is that the last thing we have? Yes, this is it. We have oh now this is pretty cool. I'm not sure I, I would have rather had Rocket, but um not sure if anybody else got anything different, but you get a Star Pop ceramic mug. I do like these. This will be my first actual one of these. And let's so let's take it out. Check it out. I do like the, I do like their home line, like the salt and pepper shakers and, and these mugs. I, I think they're just different. And I think anybody that's actually a collector and likes Marvel or likes Funko or anything of that nature, I really th see them having these around their house. Uh, just for nostalgic purposes, if anything. And I'm going to be breaking. I got all my styrofoam everywhere. Alright. Okay. So. Alright. So, yeah. It's not bad. I mean, it's. Star Lord. It's a pretty big, decent sized mug. So, yeah. Star Lord. Ceramic mob. So, no real pop figures this month. It was a bigger box. But, you got, you, this is this is different. This is nice. And, and not saying I don't like this box because I do. But I think when they, they, they um, announced that it's our biggest box ever. Kind of just thinking a little something different. Um, I know I was. Um, you only got four items. So let's go back through the items and I'll show you. Uh, I mean, you got your patch of pen, of course. Uh, Star Lord mug, which these are, I like that. First mug. These are pretty cool. These are pretty decent. They are the uh, Groot and Rocket bobblers, which are basically ornaments for your tree. Um, Giant scarf and the comic. Um, so you only got basically a total of four items in this box. I I was expecting something different, maybe I guess. Um, I'm not thrilled with every box I get. Um, it just happens. Yeah, you're going to get that with subscription boxes. You're not going to be happy with everything, or you're not going to. It's not that I'm not happy with what what this is. I didn't ex I, I think I expected just something different from them. I mean, if you're gonna if you're gonna throw out Guardians of the Galaxy, there's so much you could do with it. Um, so, but that that was it for the box. I mean, hopefully they can do better with the Deadpool box because um, I know if anybody's ever likes Deadpool. Anybody that's ever done a Deadpool box just sucked at it, so I'm kind of, I'm not holding my head high on that one, but we'll see. Uh, but I'm still going to get it regardless, because I like the Marvel and I like Deadpool, so. But, alright, tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Let me know if you guys liked what was in this month's box. Did you expect something different? Did you, did you love the box? Let me know. Um, other than that. Make sure you subscribe, comment, like, uh, hit me up on my Facebook page, definitely. And I hope you guys are having a great holiday season so far. And uh, I know it's kind of, 
I know I got to switch around, but it's kind of a warm winter here. 60 degrees, 40s at night. Uh, and I live in Ohio, so it's been kind of a mild winter so far. Keep your fingers crossed it stays that way. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Have a good one.